Eclipse Aerospace, manufacturer of the world's most fuel-efficient jet, the Total Eclipse, has changed the way the world thinks about general aviation aircraft. Since its inception, the Eclipse twin-engine jet has inspired the industry, influencing how jets are built and flown. We've had many fans and a few rivals, but no other aircraft has come close to the Total Eclipse in performance, advanced avionics, superior economics and comfort, or its unparalleled environmental responsibility. This informational video will focus on the advent of the new Avio Integrated Flight Management System, built exclusively for the Eclipse jet by Innovative Solutions and Support. Eclipse Aerospace enjoys a reliable partnership with ISNS, an industry leader with more than 20 years' experience in transforming leading-edge technologies from the PC and telecommunication industries into sophisticated, cost-effective solutions for the commercial air transport, military, and business aviation markets. They have developed glass cockpits for the Boeing 757, Pilatus PC-12, American Airlines, and many other aircraft. Advanced functionality, enhanced situational awareness, reduced pilot workload, and improved safety are just some of the many benefits found within the Avio IFMS system. We invite you to sit back and relax for the next several minutes as our pilot takes you on a quick flight utilizing the integrated flight management functions of the Avio IFMS. The main display options provided by Avio NG the main tabs at the bottom of the multifunction display, or MFD, include Active, Progress, Stored Routes, the 10 nearest airports to present position, and any user-defined waypoints. Under the map, there are three additional tabs. Nav for Navigational Display, Map for the Moving Map, XM Weather, Flight Plan, and Airspace Overlay, as well as Chart for access to all Jepson approach plates and airport diagrams. Now we'll begin our flight planning beginning from our current location, Albuquerque, New Mexico, to Front Range Airport in Denver, Colorado. We will choose our destination by selecting the destination display and pressing the insert key on the keyboard. Once the destination is highlighted, simply type the destination's airport identifier into the integrated flight management system, then press the execute button. AvioNG will now draw a magenta line on the moving map highlighting your flight route. Air Traffic Control modifies the flight plan as you have entered it, asking you to fly to Alamosa VOR via Jet Route 13. The integrated flight management system streamlines this task for the pilot. Simply highlight Albuquerque on the MFD by scrolling and select Insert. From here, Type ABQ for the Albuquerque VOR. From there, we can select Insert, scroll to Jet Route 13, and enter ALS or Alamosa. The integrated flight management system completes the route via this jet route and updates your flight plan with the waypoints from the Albuquerque VOR on J13 to ALS, saving you time from entering each waypoint. We also expect arrival into Front Range Airport. To insert your arrival procedures, simply highlight FTG on the MFD, click on Procedure, and enter your arrival. In this case, the Lark 6.
You will now see the map reflect the Jet Airway 13 to Alamosa and the Lark 6 arrival. Your modified flight plan is now complete when you press the Execute Modified Flight Plan. Another feature of the Integrated Flight Management System is its ability to plot mid-flight change of destinations quickly and easily. Let's change the course of this flight from Denver, Colorado to Colorado Springs. Scroll to the final destination on the MFD and click Edit. Once you have garnered permission from the air traffic control, simply change the identifier to Colorado Springs, KCOS, with the approach Debray 2. and press Continue. By selecting Execute Modified Flight Plan, the change is now complete. You can check the weather on the moving map to make sure that you will have clear flying all the way through. Now let's look at a different feature of the AvioNG FMS, its ability to overlay various types of maps and charts on its moving map on the MFD. Let's continue on with our flight into Colorado Springs. As you are planning your approach, simply choose Chart from the Tab Select knob on the MFD. The FMS has already preset your destination approach plates, so you then choose your expected approach, the ILS 17 left. This approach will now be overlaid on your moving map page as well as your chart page. Here you can see as you approach your destination on the moving map, the approach chart is actually transparent and overlaid onto the moving map. We will now go back into the FMS, select Destination, and select the ILS 17 left, and execute Modified Flight Plan so that the FMS is ready for the approach. Our present position is now on the instrument approach. Let's bring our chart up. We are currently at our final approach fix, Rock. As you can see, we can zoom into the map to get a closer look at our location through the overlay. Let's go a little farther into AvioNG's standard functionality by showing you what would happen if at this time we decided to implement a missed approach procedure. What's important here is that the integrated flight management system color codes the different segments of flight from route to approach and missed approach. Those color coded brackets on the FMS also overlay onto the moving map so that you can differentiate between the initial approach segment and the missed approach segment. As you can see here on the missed approach, we will be following the brown line. Once the main landing gear touches down, your position will automatically transfer to the airport diagram of our destination airport. You can track the movement of your jet down the runway and taxiway to your parking spot at the FBO. Let's look at a few more display features provided by AvioNG. First, there is the XM Weather Overlay, chosen by highlighting the Map tab at the bottom of the screen, then clicking the button next to XM Settings. The only weather in the country at this time is found over Louisiana. Let's zoom in to see more of the AvioNG's feature set. Let's look at Cloud Tops. First highlight, Enable, Return. You want to see echo tops? Choose the altitude above which you want to see the echo tops on your map. We'll look above 15,000 feet. Return. This clears our map significantly. If we go back in showing only those clouds above 20,000 feet, it thins out the display even further based upon the echo tops. The AvioNG also shows severe thunderstorms, in this case over Florida. It shows the altitude, direction, movement and speed, and width of the storm. Now let's look at the freezing levels by altitude by enabling freezing level. From here you can use the legend on the right side of the MFD for the appropriate color coded altitudes. Now let's see if we're going to pass through any air mets or TFRs.
By turning the knob, you can now step around to the various air mets and sig mets on your map by pressing the XM Select button on the right side of the MFD. Sig mets or TFRs, the small red circles on the map, can also be stepped through by turning the knob. Now let's look at checking the winds at various altitudes. Let's begin by enabling winds aloft and set the altitude to 36,000 feet. Return to map. Now go back into your map functions and change airspace to show. You can zoom into your map to see more details from the different airspaces, going back to our previous approach at Colorado Springs. And one final feature to point out in the AVONG fully integrated flight management system are Victor Airways and Jet Airways. We've shown only a fraction of Avio's capabilities, but it's evident that the total Eclipse's level of integration goes well beyond the traditional glass cockpit. Avio and the fully integrated FMS enables the most highly integrated state-of-the-art aircraft in its class. It has an extremely rich set of features and capabilities that increases safety by reducing pilot workload, providing superior systems reliability and redundancy, all of this resulting in an aircraft that is fundamentally simple and an absolute joy to fly.